So it should be clear why the Terman pioneer that he was is the reason we're having these awards. So let me get on with the awards. Um, Cisco Systems increased its corporate giving from 65 million in 2005 to 128.6 million in 2009. And its focus is investments in education for online purposes as well as information communication technologies. As a result of Cisco's efforts, over 3 million students in 168 countries have graduated from online learning academies. Additionally, Cisco offers their employees and executives the opportunity to work at a nonprofit agency for a period of time while remaining on the Cisco payroll. It is because of these contributions to our community that Cisco is being honored tonight with the Corporate Giving Terman Award. Accepting on behalf of Cisco is Alan Balutis. GE's revolutionary V-Scan, a pocket-sized visualization tool for physicians, has earned them the Breakthrough Technology Terman Award. The V-Scan uses powerful, ultra-smart, ultrasound technology to offer physicians a non-invasive and portable instrument to gain visual information about the inside of a patient's body. Previously, the image quality given by the pocket-sized V-Scan was only available with a console ultra ultrasound. The result is revolutionary portability for one of the most important items in a doctor's toolkit. Accepting on behalf of GE is Tricia O'Neill. Our remaining awards reflect the best in class in 15 segments of our industry. As the awards are announced and those and all, and all those other categories, we ask each recipient to please come to the stage to receive your award and then remain on stage for a photo. Please hold applause until the end. For Aerospace and Defense, Cognitech Incorporated Pixel 2 GPS camera was the very clear winner among four finalists in a very competitive category. And I'll do my best on pronunciation, so about a, a early a forgiveness for this. In one of the fastest growing tech fields today, the clean tech, green tech, smart grid field, Solexent Corp wins this award with its nano crystal solar cells and modules. And they were not able to be here tonight, okay? Winning in our, mo in our most popular category, cloud computing and software as a service, among 34 nominees is Mobila Corporation for G Minutes. And there's a very detailed explanation of all of these in your brochure. I chose not to read them all so you could get out of here before midnight. Samsung Electronics American Information Technology Division earned the award for computers and peripherals for the durability, portability, and outstanding performance offered by its NB30 netbook. Not able to hear tonight, okay. Uh, in the category of consumer electronics, SRS Labs Incorporated wins for its My Volume Adapter among a field of four finalists that were also not here to be, able to be here tonight. The field of cybersecurity and authentication, which we hear a tremendous amount, requires a blistering pace of innovation to stay ahead of cyber threats. So the winner in this category among 16 nominations and four finalists is Lockheed Martin for Ironclad. For electronic components, the judges cho chose Altera Corporation for its Stratix 4 GT FPGA from among the four finalists. I think I got that one right. AirCell's GoGo in-flight internet service proves the sky is not the limit for internet access and earns AirCell the award for internet services among six applicants. So you can always be connected now. Lord Kelvin said, when you cannot measure it, your knowledge is of meager and unsatisfactory kind. And a future Nobel Prize winner uh, later appended that quote with, oh, well, if you can't measure it, measure it anyhow. So the category of measurement and control 
uh, instruments was the hardest to judge. But the winner is Vectrix Electronic Systems Incorporated for SpikeSafe. In the field of medical devices, technological advances mean more accessible and better quality for patients. Aspen Medical Products wins this award for its Vista cervical collar. Unable to be here, okay? Natiza Corporation achieved the best of software and server technology for TwinFin, a rapid blade server-based appliance from among the four finalists in that category. Not here, okay? In the highly competitive field of software, we can, could only narrow down our impressive pool of applicants to five finalists, improving that safety does come first. Kaspersky Lab Americas won this category for the superior protection offered by K Kaspersky Internet Security 2010. And now a category I know a little bit about, technology consulting. CISPRO wins this award for SEAM 3. I'd like to congratulate Emphasis Technologies Limited for winning in the field of technology services for Invisualize. The nominees for our final category, telecommunications, demonstrated the vast variety of technology that keeps us continually connected offering the ability to manage these various outlets of communication to ensure we can communicate anywhere and anytime. Consumer Experience earns this award for Broadsoft. So a big round of applause to congratulate all of our award winners. Thank you.